Puba. Oh, Mark here. Oh, Mark here. With some yabba dabbas. Yabba dabba yabbos. Having so much good luck this week on backy pipes, trades, soda feed pipes, traded some pipes, got some yabbos, gotta open them up, got some packages. First one's from Brian, Big Leg Pipes, a good friend of mine. Up in Indiana, me and Brian and all of us was on the house party and uh, cutting up, looking for backing and talking. Somebody brought up fire dance. Sam Guy with fire dance, and that's what I'm smoking right now is a little Sam Guy with fire dance. And my dad's Dr. Graybo, I believe this is a oh uh, grand grand duke. Little pipe peak ball. Cheap. Uh, just something he messed around with. And uh, probably the last pipe he ever bought right there. But they say fire dance a ghost to your pipe. Now, this topping, this is this is the first bow I've had of it. I get the blueberry right on the tip of my tongue, but it's really light. Great Virginia taste. I'm really happy with the fire dance. I thought it was going to be too heavy. Everybody's talking about, oh, good blueberry topping. I was like, maybe a little bit of a topping would be cool. I'm not getting the full blueberry. I'm getting a little bit of sweetness on the tip of my tongue. Really nice. Awesome sweet Virginia taste to me. And that may be this pipe, but I was, everybody said it would ghost, so I, I hardly ever smoked this pipe, so... I dedicated it to the fire dance. And right now I'm really happy with what I'm getting out of it. So thank you, Brian, for he found a 250 gram box. And, uh, one of us mentioned you want to go in on it. And only cost me $18 for four ounces of beautiful Virginia. From Sam Gallup, if you've ever had Sam Gallup tobacco, you know it's top of the line quality. And uh, another home run for, for Sam Gallup, as far as I'm concerned. I have a little OMS coffee for kids. Mighty good, mighty good. I was. I was busy and uh, Jeremy Larson hit me up, said there's a pipe, um, smoking pipes. He sent me a picture, said it just came available on the state pipes. It was a Dagner. He knows I love the Dagners and the only mess and he sent a picture and I thought he was going to buy it. I said, you going to buy that? And he said, no, I'm just showing you. I said, I can't get it right now. I said, Miss Rhonda just left. I was busy. I was busy, busy. I said, Jeremy, buy that for me. And I'll give you money back in about an hour. He said, no problem. He had it mailed straight to me. $55. Look at this pipe. Couldn't have got it without Jeremy. Well, I know it would have been gone. Let me get up and check this. I want to show you both of these pipes. Look onto this. Look onto it. Oh, I wish my camera would work. Look onto that little pipe. And see, I collect these older ones. That's a diamond shank bent uh, Rhodesian, I guess you would call that. I guess that's what you would call that. And uh, I got the billiard. Look on to it. 
So you know I was happy to get that to add to the collection. Just awesome. Just awesome. Look on though. I'm oh so excited. So got me some good backy from Brian, a good pipe from Jeremy. You know, I'm thinking, well this week, it was last week, but and, and this week. The weekend and this week is when all this come in. Pipe come on Monday, tobacco come today from Brian. And then uh, Monday also, uh, the Briary had uh, 2010. Uh, cost me $103 a pound. Mail shipped to me. Look on to what a bag of beautiful, beautiful goodness. That's one full pound of 2010 flake. I've showed these flakes several times because I like them. Mighty, mighty good tobacco. Look in there, folks. Oh, oh my. Love this tobacco. So that was a score. Really excited about getting getting a hold of that. And then me and Ben, <clears throat> no, me and then Robbie sent me a package. Robbie, Park Frog 333. We were talking about Father Dempsey, uh, a tobacco blend from uh, Kemper's Smoke Shop. I think they closed down. I'm not sure about that, but. Anyway, somebody else is blending the uh, Father Dempsey blend. Said so I never had it. He said, I've seen you, son. He said, Robbie said, Hey, Todd, Robbie here. Sorry for the. Sorry these are so late. The unmarked bag is a sample of Father of Kemper's Father Dempsey. Enjoy my good friend. Keep on teaching the good life, Robbie. Y'all call him Robbie. I call him Roberto. That's old Roberto right there. Roberto sent me this Father Dempsey. Oh, it smells so good. Mmm. Can't wait to chew a little of it. Probably going to do it right after this bowl of uh, fire dance. Corn cob and a button nose. I told him I never had any of that. Look what a sample. He ain't stingy. Either. Corn cob and a button nose. Smells sweet to me. Mmm. I don't know if that's got a topping on it or what, but I don't know if it's aromatic. I'm going to check into it, but a nice sample. Thank you, Robbie. Mighty nice of you. Then rainy day. I've got a uh, pen of rainy day in the cellar. Somebody give me. And uh, he said he'd, he's had several pens of rainy day, one of his favorites. Sent me a great big old sample. Smells lovely too. And here's one I'm really anxious to try. This is H and H anniversary cake. Smells mighty good. Oh man. Can't wait to try that. Thank you, Robbie. Thank you, everybody. Mighty nice of you. Then me and uh me and the uh, Ben the bagpiper. I like to call him AKA Fatty. Fatty's Garage. He's a good fella. You see him all over the YTPC giving and helping and lending a hand. He, uh, every time he went after a pound of H&H uh, &H vintage Syrian. He'd hit a bunch of us up and say, hey, you want to go in on it? Well, it made it easy for me to acquire this because every time he'd done it, he'd hit me up. And I'd get a quarter pound until I got me a nice stash of vintage cereal stash back. Thank you, Fatty. Fatty Garage. Fatty's Garage, a.k.a. being the bagpiper. Awesome guy. I ain't gonna call him a newbie no more. He ain't a newbie no more. He's in. 
He's dedicated to the program. Really like old Ben. He sent me a bro note down in here. It says, Hey old buddy, hope this finds you well. I do appreciate you doing this vacuum trade with me, as well as going in on vintage searing buy. I threw in a few samples of my current favorite flakes in. Don't worry, I'll be sending you some more goodies soon. Take care and keep it lit. Old Ben, the back piper, a.k.a. Steady's Garage. He's a good boy. But any words, me and him made a trade. He had, uh, we traded ounce for ounce. He had two tens of 40th anniversary. Yes, he did. He had two tens. And, uh, I had, I had some problem working across the pond. And uh, we traded ounce for ounce for the 40th for the problem working across the pond with the rare Syrian Latakia. And uh, then he had, I don't know how many, I don't know, they know exactly how many tens of 40 he had, but he showed me some more and I said, uh, you want to get rid of any more of that 40th? And he said, he said, I wasn't thinking about it. And I showed him my OMS ants, devil's ants. I said, uh, what about what about a trade? I hooked him. I had him. He said, deal. So he had to undo the package and send me, put this in there. I got four tens from him. I'm so happy to get them. But I know he's happy to get the OMS ant. And I know he's happy to get the, uh, I know he's happy to get the, uh, across the pond. McClellan's because that was his favorite. So it was a good deal for both of us. And then he sent me some Latakia flake, number nine, Brebia. Beautiful looking flakes. Thank you, buddy. Been wanting to try that. And then he sent me another one. Black and these best. This is McClellan's uh, Latakia flake. Beautiful, beautiful flake. Get to try it. See what it was like before it's gone. That's all, folks. That's everything I've got. I've got a pound of 5,100 McClellan's coming from uh, somewhere. A good friend of mine turned me on to it and said uh, they got some down here. I still got me a pound of 5,100. I hear it's the same thing. I, I've tried both. They seem like they're identical. Uh, the 2010 and the 5100. I think I like the 5100 a little bit better. But anyway, that's uh, that's what's going on here. Just some box opening. Uh, good friend sending me stuff. Robbie and Brian hooking me up. Brady and good friends helping me find a good good pipe. It's just what the YTPs up TPC YouTube pipe community is all about. That's what we're all about. We're all about helping one another. Yes, sir, Ray. Good backing. Good friends. I was going to show, I picked up the wrong one. I was going to show uh, what Brian said. The good friends helping you get some good backing. Look on to it. Thank you, Peg Leg. This has turned out to be a nice, nice blend. I hope everybody's having a good week. I'm Bird. Thanks for stopping by. Everybody be good to one another. Go sub a newbie. Go sub anybody. Let's keep it going. We got a good thing going here. I'm Bird. I'm out. I am out.